saying this system started hitting our northern counties first and they're still getting more snow than the metro area. Kokomo has already seen 10 inches in some spots and that's where we find meteorologist Beth Pinello. So Beth, you've been in Kokomo really since yesterday morning. How's the storm changed since you first started tracking it? Hey, yeah, we got here yesterday and it was raining, quickly changed over to snow, and it is still snowing out here. Temperatures are cold, too, visibility down to about a quarter of a mile. Earlier today, we saw snow plows and a bulldozer trying to clear the roads. Unfortunately, it, it's not working. The wind has been blowing the snow back onto the road, so while some are passable, most of them are not. Kokomo Fire Chief Chris Frazier says he encourages all residents to stay home and stay off the roads. As long as we can keep the roads clear, we're not too bad. Our biggest concern is when it's windy like this. If we do have a fire and it's cold, you know, we have issues with fire hydrants being covered in piles of snow. We have issues with the wind feeding fires in these temperatures. We also talked with a Kokomo resident who's been shoveling his snow every couple of hours. He's having a really hard time keeping his stairs and his sidewalks clean. And as you can see, the snow still coming down. Reporting live in Kokomo, meteorologist Beth Finello, Fox 59 News.